Hello guys, so for this problem and for the following parametric equation, I want to show that that parametric dis equation describes the line segment between point P1 and P2. So for that, evaluate that parametric equation and t is equal to 0 and observe that you have P1 and that t is equal to 1 and observe that you have P2. Then let's sketch those two points in xy plane. But when we're going to sketch our point, I'm going to call it like A and point B, then we have a question. Uh, does that parametric equation actually describe a line segment or I'm going to go from point A to point B through some uh, curvy path? For that, what do we need to do? We need to take our parametric equation x is equal to x of t and y is equal to y of t and to show that that parametric equation describes the line. So, uh, in other words, what do we need to do? We need to take our first equation, x is equal to x1 plus x minus x2 times t, and solve that equation for t. So I'm going to move x1 to the left-hand side, and then I'm going to obtain that x minus x1 is equal to x2 minus x1 times t, or in other words, that t is equal to x minus x1 over x2 minus x1. And then I'm going to plug in the t uh, onto my second uh, parametric equation. And I'm going to obtain that y is equal to y1 plus y2 minus y1 times x minus x1 over x2 minus x1. And then we can see that that equation is actual equation of a line where uh, x and y are variables and y1, y2, x1, and x2 are uh, constants. Or if we're going to rewrite that equation, I'm going to obtain that y is equal to y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 times x. Uh, plus y minus x1 times uh, y2 minus y1 over uh, x2 minus x1. So we can see that our slope in this case is going to be y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1, and our like y-intercept is going to be y1 minus x1 times y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. And finally, let's do part B. Let's take a point negative 2, 7 and the point 3, negative 1. And what do I want to do? I want to describe the line, the parametric equation, which is going to be the line segment between point A and B. And you can see that x1 is negative 2, y1 is 7, and x2 is 3, and y2 is negative 1. Uh, or in other words, if I'm going to plug in those uh, numbers into my parametric equation, I'm going to obtain that x is equal to minus 2 plus 5t, and y is equal to 7 minus 8t. And since uh, I want to describe the parametric equation between point A and B, I need to change my t between 0 and 1. Or in other words, we are going to have the following uh, line segment, which, are, which is given by that green line segment in xy plane. Okay, guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe and have a nice day. Bye.